Okay, let's begin. Uh, hello, my name is Georgi Japaridze. I'm answering the questions. Okay, uh, we are meeting in the Vilnius on a workshop where you are learning how to assemble a station that would monitor air pollution. Why do you think Georgia needs something like this? Um, uh, in Georgia, we have air quality problems. We are measuring the air, but we, we have the um, like we don't have like monitoring system so uh it is really big problem because uh, georgia was the second place in europe uh, by air quality uh causes this uh in 2019 and 2018 georgia was uh, number one place so uh, there are many places that uh, did not um, have information about air pollution uh, air pollution so this is the um, main problem because um, we don't know uh, different cities, we don't know different uh, places, what air we breathe, but the statistic is uh, too high. So uh, the government has only uh, seven uh, monitoring system and um, it is not uh, um, too much for, for the country because that we want a monitoring system. In the public in Georgia, aware of uh, problem of air pollution of the importance of um, environmental protection in general uh, we have uh, we have the war in ukraine uh, step price increase occupation of abkhazia and south uh, south Ossetia. Ossetia. Um, how important is priority is to the people uh um yes uh, we have war uh, in, in two, two wars with russia uh, but air quality is a uh, main problem because the illness about the ecological problems and about the air pollution is too high uh, and the test is also too high. I, I tell little facts in Tbilisi 2012-2021, uh, it was 150,000 uh, cases about um, uh, air pollution, um, not deaths, but illness. Uh, so uh, 50,000 cases was under nine uh, years old age children. So um, yes, um, it is a big problem uh, and we are working on it to make the raise the awareness about their pollution and i think we made made it a lot so now people think um, that is a real big problem because uh, when we have we make the signatures we make the 30,000 signatures in one month uh, nine of ten people agree with it uh, so it's a um, really big statistics how do you personally get involved with the environmental protection uh Okay. Uh, in 2018, um, uh, when I begin this movement, uh, I just want to change something. But uh, when uh, after and after I uh, read many statistics, many things about the air pollution, about um, air quality, about the climate change, and the statistics about this, um, of course, it is a really um, big uh, statistics in Georgia. So um, I think the main problem of Georgia is the um, ecological problems. And uh, of course, uh, uh, we are working on to change um, about uh, air, water and food quality, and uh, we are working on it. Okay. Mm, your organization focuses a lot of Tbilisi. We are uh, practical on the health of the population of Georgia lives and we are uh, the bad air, air is manual cut by uh, continuous flow of cars. Um, are people are um, politicians ready for the change that must come? Um, uh, all it uh, already will change because we when we get the signatures um, now we are official with the government to get the law uh, and uh, probably ninety nine percent the law we get get in a budget of two thousand twenty three is already um, about the changing about the cars uh, so um, the government when I speak to the different uh, politicians politicians and uh, they officially uh, talking about it. Uh, I think, um, yes, it will be um, following uh, the ecological problems and following about the changing the car. Because not only this law, what uh, we make the signatures, a different laws is changing. Uh, and uh, probably in, in 2023 will be the big changes about the cars. And uh, I think that um, air, air quality will um, change, will be good. Uh, so now after after these laws must be the monitoring system, of course, and uh, we are ready for this. So uh, we have communication with the government, and um, I think it is it is not a big problem. Okay. Um, do we have any idea what the situation is like in other cities uh, in the similar settlements? Do we want to deal with the 
other sort of pollution that can trouble the residents there uh, are other than car traffic. Mm, okay. Uh, not only in Tbilisi, uh, the uh, uh, polluted area, um, of course, we are working in a whole country, but we live in Tbilisi, and the main problem is Tbilisi because uh, one, one in 300,000 people live in Tbilisi, and uh, therefore I, we, um, and our team. So uh, the main problem is also in Rus Rustavik, Aspi, um, um, uh, Poti, uh, Batumi, Kutaisi, and uh, Chiatura, different cities. Uh, we know we have communication with the main uh, activists. Uh, also, our team members live uh, live in these places. So, uh, of course, we know the situation where the uh, in what cities is the polluted area because we are communication in, with uh, Georgian activists and we have many followers in, with different cities with different um, settlements. So, yes, we know the places. Okay, your organization uh, managed to collect. 30,000 signatures in 2021 in order to promote a change in the law technical. Um, uh, okay, well, we're able to, okay. Uh, I'll, um, I'll already uh, tell that, uh, that it changes will be uh, because officially uh, our organization with the government gets this law to the parliament and now we are waiting that parliament will uh, add it. So 99% um, this law will be uh, changed. So uh, we will be there first number one or the first organization uh, like uh, in Georgia to changing uh, some laws so it, it will be changed. Your cooperation was <coughs> Arnica is starting this year. What you expect for this collaboration? <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, first, yes, we, we have a, a communication uh, before in 2022, uh, and uh, in this workshop where, where uh, are we now, it is really good, and I think that's our uh, communication, our collaboration will be the good for Georgia, uh, because uh, we we will share uh, some uh, big, big information about air quality. You have uh, too much experience about these uh, projects um, about air quality, so um, I think it will be successfully and uh, will be some changes in our country. In, uh, in the future of uh, the uh, planet, a topic for young people in a number of European countries. We see a fairly messy Fridays for future government. If something similar happens in Georgia. In our team, uh, 50% of uh, our members is the young people. So, of course, we are fighting about uh, climate change. Mm, um, and uh, we have uh, actions in uh, Tbilisi. But the main main problem uh, for us is the main pollution. Uh, so, the globally, mm, there is not uh, too much uh, knowledge about uh, and the global uh, problems, but we are sharing sharing the information to the our uh, followers, uh, and uh, we are making the, um, translating the texts uh, from to, in English to Georgia. To we are making posts about the climate change, about the eco tips. We have um, eco books to go. We are, we are going to school and um, learning some children. We are giving this book for free uh, for the future. That will be the big changes for them. Not, not only for Georgia, but for the world, because we, we are living the same world. But uh, for now, we are beginning uh, like this movements um, to, to the global climate change. Georgia is a popular holiday destination for residents of Czech Republic. <clears throat> you would have wild nature and such a historical uh, heritage that is re rarely found anywhere. Can Georgia parallelly base its future on Nature conversation. Oh, conservation. Oh, okay, nature protection. Yeah. Of course. Um, uh, in Georgia, we have a um, beautiful country. <laughs> uh, and uh, we have wild nature. We have uh, too many rivers. We have water, nature, um, climate. Uh, so, uh, but the problem is uh, the illegal hunters, uh, too many illegal hunters, they are cutting the trees and uh, I think the Georgia should must go on to protect the areas uh, about uh, big parks to make too many tourists, uh, ecological tourists. So, um, this, this will be the 
better way to uh, make uh, our country because we have already it's by nature we have this climate we have um, mountains and the sea so uh, the protecting of the trees but prote protecting of the green area is uh, must be the um, main uh, problem must be the main uh, goal from our government. And of course, we are uh, protecting, also we have some uh, uh, activists, um, uh, activities to protecting the local um, green spaces and the government, uh, I think the, I think the government should go this way to make these parks, big parks as uh, in many different countries and uh, it uh, must be protected, it must be the clean that uh, tourists go on, that the climate will be good and fresh air and um, the nature will renewable by itself. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. And okay. Have a nice Everything. day. <laughs>